What's going on, everybody? Welcome on in. We have made $26 today trading NBDA. Let's cover the trade recap. Um, this really was supposed to, I mean, supposed to, it, it, this was supposed to be where I was targeting about $150, $160 in terms of my um, targeted PL on the day trade. And I was risking about $80 to $90. And it just didn't hit either one. Uh, so if you saw the live stream, uh, we I got out of it with like eight minutes left to go in the day just because nothing happened. You know, it just, it just didn't do anything. So here's the trade. Pretty straightforward was this breakout above the highs right here on the five minute time frame. Very strong move early, followed by about an hour of consolidation. Good to see. Putting pressure on the highs, trending up. All things that I want to see, right? And it broke. We got in, it happened on higher volume, great sign, cool. And we did trend higher generally, but just never really did much. My ultimate target was 927, which is up here, which we got, I mean, we had, we were five bucks away. So not bad, but not great. And then my stop loss was originally around 911, which is down here. So that never hit, take profit never hit. We literally just ranged all day in between take profit and stop. So I just got out of it towards the end of the day, somewhere in here, and it ended up only making me $26, which is great. I mean, it's not bad. It's not a bad thing. It's not an amazing thing. It's just a, a thing, you know? And so sometimes it's how it goes. I haven't had one of these in a while. Usually they hit take profit or stop, but this one didn't do either one. So that was it. Now, okay, one criticism to myself, what could I have done here differently? I could have seen that it was not doing anything and just gotten out because this could have easily just done this and then I would hit my stop and that would be it. What I did do though is I did quickly, not quickly, but as we pushed up here, I moved my stop loss to break even. So I couldn't lose and, and it almost stopped me out break even here, but then it didn't break, break it didn't hit the stop loss. And so I ended up just getting out shortly after for a slight gain. Call it a slight gain, call it a break even trade, wherever you want to call it. It's going to throw my stats off. And I say that jokingly, but also kind of seriously uh, because we've only taken three trades so far this month. And now our average winner is 58 bucks, which is kind of, eh. Uh, you know, again, we'll see how this plays out, but there'll be some losers in there for sure. So currently, Guess what, guys? You should probably buy everything, and I'm going to sell you this Discord group and this next mentorship because I have a 100% win rate. So I'm going to leave a link in my bio, and that is going to be a $6,000 a month mentorship, and I'm going to show you how to become a 100% win rate trader off of three trades and making $174. <laughs> uh, all seriousness, the next I have two open trades, Silver and Home Depot. None of those have hit take profit or stop yet. Silver looks promising. Market's trending up, so Home Depot could be promising any, any day if, if the markets continue to go higher. But we'll see. That's the current update. That's where we are. And I'll leave links to Tradezilla down below if you want the exact software that I use to track, journal, and log all my trades. Peace. Enjoy.